all of our viewers from around the world. We have quite a game in prospect here, just waiting for the players to emerge, and we will be underway. And here we have Udinese against Sampdoria. This is Peter Drury, and next to me, providing insights, will be Jim Beglin. Well, I can tell you, I'm truly delighted to join you, Peter, and, and thank you very much for that. things running comes it's broken loose Moisanda very firm in standing his ground there it is a tough full contact contest Zapata, this is promising, he's in, surely, and he's onside, and he's there to hoof it away, and he's pulled him up for that challenge, to get it away deftly done away from immediate danger it'll be a throw in it upfield still going where to next Zapata oh well defended that had to be done Udinese have had plenty of possession but few, if any, genuine chances. Locks it in gently. Clears it out of harm's way. Plays it out to the flank. the through ball oh that's neat shows one in and that's been repelled who 
Udinese have a free kick. And that's going to be a booking. Has looked from so far out, but that was close. I mean, they kept the keeper on his toes. Castano looks to dink one in. It's a good run down the left hand side. on the first 45 minutes. Well, they've never really been threatened in the first half. I think it's been a magnificent team effort. The work rate has been superb. Very, very organised. Interesting half, just missing goals. So don't be surprised if the second half brings a change to the scoreline at the break. Nil-nil. Whistle goes, and we start the second half. Udinese can feel really happy with themselves. The scoreline doesn't back it up, but they've played with urgency and purpose and can't afford to lose patience in this second half. They've got to persevere. That's good defence. Uh, plain and simple, good defence. They refuse to allow a turn. controlled and he has been fouled there and the ref's being lenient here and I can't he'll get too many more chances trying to do for me Peter what are they trying to do well I think they're making the pitch as big as possible to work both flanks into into better supply routes Fagliarella spreads it wide think it's a, a conservative move to deny runners the opportunity of, of going beyond that rear guard. Who's going to make this theirs? Uh, he 
apologies that he should have come up with something better there. Yeah, and the vision to get him through was all good, but the execution of the pass wasn't quite right. But importantly, he's holding his line until the very last moment, and that will pay off. He just stood firm. Yeah, that does look a foul. Referee's given a free kick. That was a beautifully struck shot from so far out. And I just thought he was a little unlucky then. This is gone, that's a foul. Well, oh, that's a booking, always looked it. Safety. Listen, it may well finish this way because it's been so tight all the way through, but equally, we might still get a moment of magic mistake or a refereeing decision to influence otherwise. Looks like a good ball through. Has a swing at it! In it goes! And that could well be the winner! Well, he was never going to miss from there. So much to aim at. It's really a problem when that much time is afforded in the penalty box. Nobody sensed where the danger was lurking, and the finish was made a lot easier. Udinese take the lead. Oh, this is fully deserved for me because they've shown great heart and spirit. It's there to win from here, or dare I say, throw it away now. Now it's Muriel. They get a throw in. Played in again. Fence has got rid of that. Deep into stoppage time. Udinese just have to run down the clock. Tries a through ball. And the flag has stayed down. 
ball to play him in, but he will be gutted to miss that. I think there's always that danger that the defence can get exploited in that way. That must have served as a real wake-up call to them. end it flew by and in the end it all came down to just the odd goal thrilling nail biting perhaps frustrating until the very end but we do have a winner well i just think that determination and persistence has paid off handsomely to to squeeze the win out of a draw sometimes